A nonprofit from Portsmouth is in Tennessee right now to help people who survived the deadly tornadoes. The Mercy Chefs are serving meals to volunteers and really anyone out there without a home right now. Allie Weatherton talked to the group's founder. She joins us in studio with more details. Allie. He says several volunteers from Portsmouth are serving. They drove down on Tuesday, even bringing a mobile kitchen with them from Oklahoma, and they just want to help the people who really need it. Mercy chefs are there to help in times of need. This is one of those times. They're serving meals to volunteers who are helping people affected by the deadly tornado that hit Nashville this week. They're also feeding those survivors. Where we're set up has power. But the houses around us do not have power. And this is one of the more disadvantaged areas of Nashville that we're in. We always go to the heart of the need. We caught up with Gary LeBlanc on FaceTime. He said the group is staying in East Nashville. You watch somebody eat one of our meals and you know that you've touched their soul. Um, you've, not, you've fed the soul, not just the body. And for me, it's the most humbling and rewarding thing at the same time. It's something simple that's helping people get through a devastating period. Just looking at these images is rough. Homes and businesses are gone, not to mention the people who died. Well, you can see the tornado path clearly. Trees on either side are still upright, but then everything between those upright trees is just sheared off five, ten feet above the ground. For LeBlanc, it's about comfort, and it comes by giving people one good meal at a time. And Mercy Chefs plan to stay in Nashville as long as they are needed. They say they are working all weekend long and into next week. Crews plan to reevaluate the need later in the week. Allie Weatherton, 13 News Now.